few things. Chum. Granny needs to do something with her hair. I'm looking straight up crazy. Look at this. <laughs> Take this thing out of my head. We are in food. We're in food lion. And get a few little things right quick. Like I said, I don't know who Mary B is, but she makes some freaking good biscuits. <laughs> I told y'all before my biscuits are like white hockey pucks. Let's get over here. The other thing that I do like is um I can find them. It's kind of how, in a way, I can keep my weight down, and I do like the taste of them. I can find some. Now, this is the Morning Star brand. Okay. Now, there's the Griller's Original. And then you can go over and try the Mediterranean Chickpea even have uh, fake hot dogs, fake sausage, that kind of thing. So what I like to do is just get two different types. It doesn't take much to please me. <laughs> I can't see myself. All right, I should have got a cart. <laughs> you ever think that you're going to uh, just buy one or two things? because it's just you. <laughs> and you're like, oh, wait a minute. I forgot that. Oh, wait just a second. Let me get that. <laughs> so yes, time is winding down uh, for Granny. And I am tired, but let me tell you something. I am so freaking excited. And um, after today's blessing, that has lightened my load. I was so concerned about something. How many of you know that um, if you worry a bit too much, you're not showing your Heavenly Father that you have faith? But what did I say before? You are to praise Him as though everything's okay. Sorry about that. There we go. I really, I think I showed you this before. I love this um, Fiesta Jack cheese. And uh, I'm having to um, behave myself a little bit better. I've put on about, I don't know, <laughs> you know, when you're just doing ordinary chores and taking care of things and you're not moving as much as you should, I don't care who you are, uh, you're going to put on some weight, and I have, and I'm uncomfortable, you know. First thing that happens with me, it goes right around the belly. My pants start getting tight and going, hey! You better do something or we're not going to fit. <laughs> Anyways, let's just keep going. Okay, I'm going to segment right out right here. I'll be right back. Welcome back, kids. Hey, here's something we haven't done in a while. <laughs> in peace and quiet, that is. <laughs> Yes. Oh, speaking of gorgeous, poor little thing, you have no idea what's about to happen to you in a few weeks. <laughs> well, uh, I just wanted to share right quick uh, some mail that I did get. Uh, let's see here. I got this today. Let's that open it. Good job. And the cats decided to participate with us. <laughs> and here is this beautiful card that I received. And uh, it says. You're sweet and sunny, you're funny and bright, and you shine in the world with your own special light. Now, here are 
the YouTube channels for this wonderful, wonderful person. Thank you so very, very much. I won't read the rest of it. And let's see, next up. This open. <laughs> She's suffering so much. <laughs> this is a nice, happy Easter card. And we'll just get over to what it says right here. May the brightest, happiest joys be yours at Easter time and always. And that card is has up more notes inside, which I'll keep to myself. That is from Grandma Cheap Cheap. Thank you so much, dear heart. Thank you so very much. And last but certainly not least, This is so cute. Looks like Paris with a balloon. And my cat is a nut job. She likes eating paper. <laughs> and this is a from Kismet. Kismet. So I thank you so, so very much for your kind words and this beautiful you have it. Some lovely cards from some wonderful folks. And as you can see, once again, I know it looks kind of sparse, my mother's china thingy is in my bedroom. Had to be because right where you see that wiry looking thing, and there was a crib right there. <laughs> Carpet looks like heck. I'm going to have to clean that before I get out of here. Yes, they have been given their notice. Yes, they have. Y'all already seen my uh, lovely biscuits. Now let's move this out of the way here. And of course, y'all, some of y'all know that I love this uh, wheat flatbread. I absolutely love that. I just love it. And of course, I selected the Morning Star Mediterranean Chickpea variety. And then the Morning Star Grillers Originals. These taste absolutely delicious. Love them. I think they're about three dollars and ninety-nine cents, and you get four. So you're spending what fifty cents a burger, which isn't pretty fair. And uh, don't know how y'all feel about these, but sometimes I just heat these up. I love sweet potatoes, and I love yams. Anyways, I thought I'd just uh, see how everybody was doing and let you know what's happening. Uh, like I say, um, the uh, apartment folks have been given their notice uh, as to my departure. I was just talking to my neighbor uh, downstairs, there's a, a couple downstairs. They're leaving in the month of June, June. So in this building there will be three empty apartments. Yes, indeed. A gentleman across the way, um, a DJ friend, has been here a lot longer than me. I do believe he was finally done with it, with his complete move last Friday. There are a lot of us. It's kind of eerie. A lot of us are leaving uh, within weeks of one another. So anyways, I hope all is well in YouTubeville. Uh, Granny is still kicking and ever so humbled and grateful what the Lord has provided through the kindness of many of you and of that wonderful kind relative that thoroughly blessed me today. Uh, thank you so much for your kind words. Uh, thank you so much new subscribers. I think our subscriber family is over 1400 now and I am ever so grateful to each and every one of you that are new subbies and also to the ones that have been with me from the very beginning uh, I am soon to be traveling um, the furniture that I have here a lot of it's in pretty bad shape that's why a lot of the time you'll see it's covered it's in pretty rough shape the items in rough shape will be thrown out there's two huge items but my dining room and my bedroom set 
there is a couple living downstairs that have a brand new baby I think she is seven months now and I brought hubby upstairs and I said take a look is there anything that you think you would need and he looked quite happy so we're gonna go ahead and give those items to that couple downstairs yes indeed I love you so very very much thank you for your prayers which have been more than answered please continue to do so I am ever so grateful for that love you thank you for watching this video and I'll see you uh, pretty soon on the next one bye my friends